Unionized workers at Raven Software are now at the center of a contentious dispute with their parent companies, Activision Blizzard and Microsoft. The workers, who successfully unionized in 2022, have recently filed a complaint with the National Labor Relations Board, that is NLRB, accusing both tech giants of engaging in bad faith bargaining. The complaint, lodged last Friday, highlights serious allegations that Microsoft and Activision Blizzard are not negotiating in good faith. The workers' frustrations have reached a boiling point as they struggle to secure their first collective bargaining agreement, a crucial step for establishing fair labor practices within the company. The specific accusations in the complaint include claims of refusal to bargain, bad faith bargaining, as well as issues surrounding changes in terms and conditions of employment and potential concerted activities, which could involve retaliation or disciplinary actions against workers involved in union activities. Claude Cummings Jr., president of the Communications Workers of America, that is CWA, expressed disappointment over the situation. He noted, after Microsoft's acquisition of Activision Blizzard, our members were hopeful that progress toward a fair contract at Raven Software would be swift. Unfortunately, that has not been the case. We urge Microsoft to address the concerns raised in this unfair labor practice charge and prioritize reaching a fair agreement. The background to this dispute is notable. Raven Software became a pioneer in the game industry by unionizing, making it the first major studio to do so. This move came amid Microsoft's ongoing acquisition of Activision Blizzard, and it was hoped that the transition would lead to a more favorable environment for workers. Microsoft had previously signed a labor neutrality agreement with the CWA in 2022, which was supposed to facilitate a fair process for unionizing employees. This agreement was later extended to include Xenomax workers, but it seems the promises made may not have fully materialized. Microsoft has responded to the NLRB complaint by asserting their commitment to negotiating in good faith. A spokesperson stated, We are committed to negotiating in good faith, aiming to address the allegations raised. Despite this assurance, the situation remains tense, as Raven Software employees have participated in multiple bargaining sessions since their union's formation, yet they have not achieved significant progress. This situation is emblematic of the broader challenges facing unionized workers in the tech and gaming industries. The outcome of this complaint could set important precedents for how labor negotiations are handled in the future. The CWA continues to advocate for workers' rights, and the resolution of this dispute will be closely watched by both industry insiders and labor advocates. As the situation develops, it will be crucial to monitor how Microsoft and Activision Blizzard address the concerns of their employees and whether they can move toward a resolution that upholds fair labor practices and respects the rights of unionized workers. Stay subscribed for more videos.